closed captioning. Oh, you can't have hope you build. Don't screw this build. How nice. All right, thanks, Soren. <laughs> hope I don't too. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Denim dude, thanks so much for the tier two for four months. Thank you. Stormer KBDs with the five. Uh, Blue Goose with the prime. John Firo with the bits. Ada goes with the seven. Junia with the eleven. My switch Kotor allyship. Nice. Sudan SMC thing with the bits. Sam's keycaps with a prime sparrow and with the 16 arc hala things for the three months rose's garden with the eight hope you're doing well i saw i'll send you some lucicator lucicotter from sweden hope they hold up what's lucicotter lucicator what is that but thank you nuna duck things with six months powers are there with the six uh quackers clack with the seven hello carbide with the prime brian the mandalorian with the two months thank you for filling my brain with keyboards <laughs> francis odyssey with a tier two sub thank you ryan z with the prime sub ender always taken thank you for the two months wtf is this feature what wobbly chubbly with the two months mike sg mike sgt with the prime j with the eight months imagine paying twice for a stream oh i saw <laughs> Daniel Alexander with the two months, Joey Saladino with the four. Uh, yo, Tyler with the one year, hello. Devastating Child with the prime, franchise with the 17. Just spent two G's on Vega and K because of you. Wait a minute, two G's? Wait, isn't a G a thousand dollars? Is my street knowledge wrong? What is a G? of cash is g a hundred no g is a thousand why there's no way you paid two g's for a k and vega unless you paid aftermarket prices maybe i say i'm sorry with the bits uh solly js park with the five rainbow illuminati with the two uh thank you thank you fugitive legacy with the prime less with the five no zip jumper hell yeah Dude, you're disappointing us? Wait a minute, two G's? That's 2K, no? Isn't a G equal to a K? How much is 2G in cash? The symbol, that symbol is a, yeah, G is $1,000. We need to do things to your streaming space? Ooh, like what, Tyler? I'm down. I'm also due for a refresh for why didn't you ping my chat? I don't know. I want to change my like overlays. Should I have chat? I should keep chat. Hello. Ideally, I don't want chat, but people actually watch my vods on YouTube and they like reading chat, so I should keep it. But I don't know. I don't know if this is the best position for. It. I don't know where to put chat or how to change it. Uh, Josh Park. Think of the bits. Mobile suit. Gangnam. Think of one of the four months. Oh, it's Lucas with the six months. Hi, Appa. Why don't you pick my chapaguri? It was not good. <laughs> Boners, Venus with the five months. Just another Kim with the prime. Untrue neutral TV with the tier one. Zuckus with the eight. It's almost time for our baby. Yes. A plays with the tier three. Thank you, thank you. Full send with the two. Oh, I think I'm caught up. The one true weasel with the tier one. Bashy with the two months. Mikey Pay with the three months. I think the um, Vega is still in stock, right? Not in stock, but the group I still open. You guys can still join. Oh, we have Grace. Hello. Doctor Who's here too. Hello. So mean. Loose Cotter is a Swedish bull. Buell bull. Also known as bun in English. Made with saffron. Oh, you're going to ship me bread from Sweden? It's probably going to be bad by the time it comes here. <laughs> but I guess I could try it. Wow. This is a coffee house. Take all of your tea out of my lawn. Yeah, this is a coffee house. But we don't discriminate against tea. Tea is okay too. But coffee is the way to go. Free mold. You can't pass that up. All right. I'm going to assume no Mr. Sleeves le two leaks then. Oh, Urban. Hello. Uh, I have been given permission to make the announcement. I am being forced to play my cards. <laughs> uh, with everything that's happening, we are expediting running Mr. Sleeves. 
Mr. Sleeves will run pretty soon. So hopefully that lines up for people who are planning on joining Muted 2. Uh, let me let me let me tell you guys my timeline. I've been working. So my initial plan was to come up with a full base kit that wasn't copying muted, <laughs> but also wasn't copying minimal. <laughs> I feel like minimal, muted, and 9009 are the three sets that work best with Mr. Sleeves. So I wanted to come up with an entire base kit for round two. So I had been working on that. Uh, I was very close to final, I had pretty much chosen colors, I think. I was just finalizing the kitting. And then, and then, uh, and sorry, and then the Mito set came out. That was a couple, that was like a month ago, two months ago. And then Muted Retro came out yesterday. And then, <laughs> and then Krullbit told me uh, in advance that he had secured Muted. So I was like, oh, okay, <laughs> well, maybe there is no point in me putting out a base kit because all these sets are coming out. So I have decided yesterday to just scratch whatever, whatever I was doing for my base kit and I'm just going to rerun it as an add-on kit again. Uh, hopefully this time around it will be better. I am going to rerun it as a add-on kit only and it will have support for all kinds of mods. Uh, not that there's a lot. Uh, I mean, the escape key, function keys don't have different mods, but for enter, I will provide text only support, mod only support, or icon only support, text plus icon. And I think I'm also going to add arrow keys, uh, accent arrow keys, sorry. That will also have Dixie mod support and regular support, I think. I'm wondering if I should I should support Dixie mods because minimal sold quite well. Yeah. Alice space bars, yes, there will be Alice space bars. Alice, there will be a 3U, not 3U, uh, there will be yeah, Alice space bar support. I will extend the space bars past just the, uh, the 7U, 6U boys. There will be space bar support. So I'm on saying no. No to what? Text only, can we ban the streamer? Well, so the thing is minimal is text only. I feel like it's weird to mix minimal with icon. Yeah, it sucks because minimal is text only. <laughs> Muted is icon only. Uh, I forget what white on black uses. Does white on black use, is it text plus icon? GMK white on black. No, mute white on black is also, uh, is it icon only? No, white on black is text plus icon, I think. Whatever. It sucks that people go different routes. And I feel like it's weird to make people mix and match. Just make dice of instead? From who though? From where? But yeah, Mr. Sleeves, round two coming back um, pretty soon. So you, if you guys don't bug Krellbit about Mr. Sleeves, he got bugged quite a bit after he announced uh, IFK me sleep. What's IFK? Dude, am I a boomer today? What are all these acronyms? IFK meaning. Indirect free kick. What? Oh, Infinity. Oh, no. No. No Infinity. <laughs> Is that how people are abbreviating Infinity now? IFK? Oh. <laughs> when can we expect HK Gaming Mr. Sleeves? Dude, I wouldn't be surprised if that's already in the works. Come on, it's HK Gaming we're talking about. Why do you nerds keep doing three letters? Yeah. Looking forward to sleeves, striker two, circa round two, hamon round two, zambamon. Ooh. You said the H word? What's the H word? HK gaming? <laughs> but yeah, Mr. Sleeves round two will be happening. Plus more. I have more planned. 
more plan. We are getting prototypes. More coming. Whoa, Sam Schaefer. Hello, thank you so much for the three months. Smile. Chris Carr, thank you so much for three months. Red with the seven months. Invis with the 23. One more month. Thank you, thank you. But what that with the nine months. Landai Kobuchi with the four months. NP with the four. Uwu can't wait for the bidet review. What? Gold PP with the prime. Haichi with the 11 months. No Ploxy with the prime. Semi Doge with the two months. Perp Grab with the prime. Sir Calvin Saldi with the 10 months. Jeff Leopard with the 19 months. Death to Mod Color Pipe and Toto. Hot Lemon Tea with the six months. The Rice Maker with the eight months. Oh, yes. There will be no Mod Colored Pipe or Tilda in Mr. Sleeves, by the way, because they should not exist. Doopy things are with the 20 months. K's with the two months. Roses Garden with the bits. Some news for you. After Striker 2, I'm making a new set. Ooh, I see. Yeah. You guys want to know how to avoid uh, getting bombarded by requests for stupid keycaps like Mod Tilda and Mod Pipe and 1.75 Backspace? Just run an add-on kit. Don't have a full base kit. Less stress to worry about. <laughs> Don't need to have people coming to me to complain. <laughs> um, get DCS grab cat. Was Mr. Sleeves actually $58? Yes. Uh, Wait a minute, Gok NZ saying mod pipe is the best. It works well on wider. Oh, okay, okay, Mr. Gok. Okay, time to revoke his uh, VIP. I'm just kidding. <laughs> yes, Mr. Sleeves was pretty expensive. I envision any any accent. Sorry, any accent kit is going to cost a lot, especially since this is not running with a base kit. Uh, it's going to cost a lot, but hopefully. It's a little bit more reasonable this time around. You're, you're getting more keycaps for it. We haven't gotten a quote yet, but yeah, hopefully. Hopefully this time around it's better. <sighs> Hitches every... Uh, is my stream laggy? Should I lower my bitrate? I am streaming at 7,200 bitrate. If I were to ask you what keyboard should I get and you get to pick the parts, what it, would it consist of? Ooh, that's very vague, Sam. It's, I would need a bit more questions and answers from you. Highly dependent on your budget, what you're looking for, uh, how much time you're willing to wait. Waiting is a big part of the keyboard community, so. It's fine? Okay. Maybe John just has ISP diff. Very fine. On what? No budget? I can wait? Ooh, no budget and he can wait. Oh, we can definitely talk. If you have no budget and you can wait, we can. We might as well just go full custom. Just get you a one of one keyboard. A truly custom tailored to Sam. We can have your logo engraved. I don't know if you wanted an if you wanted an, a graphic of you skateboarding on the back of your keyboard. We could do it. Tons of stuff. I want the Teha experience. <laughs> the Teha experience is not that special. December 10th is my birthday. Please send number 265. Thank you. Okay, Jax. Wait, you have a freaking CNC machine. <laughs> you can just clone the number 265. If you were to build any keyboard with any keycaps and switches, no budget, what would you build? Uh, I would just probably make, ask someone to make my own or make me a one of one. If you can, if you clone it, make a Reddit thread. Can't afford number 265, so I made my own. <laughs> All right, <clears throat> shall we get to the build? Okay, so I was supposed to stream yesterday, but uh, I got cucked by FedEx. Both yesterday's build and today's build were overnighted. <laughs> the, these clients were cutting it close. They literally overnight shipped. Uh, they're two different people. I was supposed to build the Mode 80 yesterday. 
They overnighted it, didn't arrive on time. Uh, Key Cult overnighted this build. <laughs> Thankfully, it did arrive on time. I literally drove out to the post office to pick this up before I started the stream. So very rushed. Um, but yeah, we, today's build was saved. Overnight a key call? Yes, this was overnighted. Um, so this is a production unit number 265 as the title implies. There's no top or bottom? Oh, it's probably like this. Are you doing a full build? Today, yes. Today I am doing a full build. So yeah, this is a production unit number two. Completely made in-house, I believe. I don't know about the packaging, but as for the case itself, the machining, the finishing, we can now say Key Cult. Key Cult is pretty much like 95% able to have the Made in USA label. Anodizing, I believe Key Cult has been in the works of getting anod or anodizing done in house. Well, not in house, but in the States. It wouldn't really make sense to machine in the US and then ship it over to China to anodize. I feel like that's inefficient. <laughs> that doesn't really make sense, right? If you're gonna machine here in the States, you might as well get it finished here in the States, especially at the volume uh, Key Cult is operating at. So let's see. A lot of people had doubts that the Key Cult guys could not be trusted with a CNC machine, and they are proving haters wrong every day with every new keyboard that they have been machining. Let's see how this uh, finishes. Cause I think we, I think based off the raw aluminum number 265 that we've seen, I am pretty confident in Key Cult's ability to operate a CNC machine. How can you really doubt Zach and George? They're both really smart guys. People just hating for no reason. All right. Uh, no, they cannot be trusted with espresso machines. CNC was never in doubt. <laughs> so it's the keyboard case. So this here, Mr. Sam, this is a Key Cult keyboard. Key Cult is a brand slash company. They're based in North Carolina. And this is their keyboard. This is one of the models they are going to be selling pretty soon. This is an upcoming model. It, is, it has not run yet. Uh, I am. I think I'm the first to show a production unit. Uh, we have shown off prototypes in the past before, but yeah, their packaging is insane. But this is their box. Uh, they label which model you're getting. Key Cult Premium Mechanical Keyboards, number two model, 65% form factor, black, brass. Release is November. Oh, release November? Oh, November's over though. <laughs> so hopefully this runs, I don't know, maybe next month. Yeah, it comes nicely padded. It's like specialty beer? Yeah, it's like specialty anything really. Uh, there are two, two, two dudes out of North Carolina. Very nice folks. They actually even live stream the process on Twitch. Um, they've been not as not so much as of late, but You can see them working the CNC machine on their stream sometimes if you want to check it out All right Are you ready to see the black and brass variant? Ah, uh, cut All right, still got that nice angled cutting Ooh. Ooh. Smells like quality foam Oh, this is heavy. <laughs> this is heavy. Um, sock leading 
you so much for the four months. So no she thinks the tier one nachos or barbecue with the four months. If Razer paid you one mil a year for the rest of your life, but you could only use stock Razer keyboards with MX Blues without any mods, would you take it? Dude, hell yeah, one million a year for the rest of my life? I don't have to work. I would take that. I don't know who wouldn't. That's kind of <laughs> one mil is a lot of money per year. Vulcan Monkey, thank you so much for the prime. Chronic Nitrin, thank you so much for the tip. Greetings new here, but thanks for the amazing content. Thank you. Extra lean with the bits. Unwanted pro with the prime. ASMR feet sucking with the bits. I'm Iris for the three months. Just ordered myself a Winkyless K. First really high-end keyboard. Craigasm gonna be a long way to get. Yeah, hopefully you like it. I like it. Jason MG with the Prime. I teach Gosu with the four months. Hope you had a good Thanksgiving. I did. Hope you guys did too. Roxon with the three months. Senpai, notice me, please. Traveling with the tier one sub. Paven MTL with the seven months. Thank you, thank you. Roman GTZ with the Prime. Daxian with the 15 months. Shil Smiggles with the eight. Riser with the Prime. All right, we're caught up. Oh! Oh! This is heavy. So this is the side profile. Wow. Look at this sleek side angling. Ooh, looks clean. This is the uh, the brass bottom. It's got the key cult logo engraved into the brass. No visible external screws. One of the nice features about this high profile, seamless, <clears throat> screwless design. This is the back. Ooh. That's a good back. That's a good seam right here. Very nice suit. Yeah, very nice suit. This is the result of a made in USA, North Carolina. the finest of keyboard makers in the US. Dude, you don't see the brass peeking out at all. Actually, maybe slightly there, but it's probably not screwed in all the way. Okay, let's take, a, let's take some close-ups of the Anno. Uh, you are starting to see some of my fingerprint, my oils, but that is one of the downsides of getting an all black keyboard. This is not banding. This is due to the uh, the change in curvature here. In case this looks like banding, it is not banding. It's just the edge design. Uh, same same here as well. It's pretty smooth. I like it. Yeah, this is smooth. Yeah, so this is all... I, <laughs> the moment you touch a black keyboard, like your, your finger oil just kind of gets on it. You have to, you do have to wipe it down consistently if you grab it, but... Pretty nice! Let's take a look at the internals. Key Cult, number 265. Boom. That's the serial number of this unit. There's the daughter board for the USB port and then the cable, JST cable. Ooh, looks clean. Even the finishing on the inside looks nice.
Oh man, today was not a good day to use a black desk mat. <laughs> oh wells. Oh wells. Is the daughter board suspended or is it flush with the brass bottom? Uh, it is suspended technically. It's screwed onto this mid piece. We're gonna open this up in a second. But this is a three piece case. There is a top, there is a mid piece that you don't really see currently. And then this brass here is a base plate. So this daughter board is attached to the mid piece currently. Oh, I should zoom out a little more. All right, what else comes in here? Zway the Doge, thanks for the prime sub. So batastic with the two months. Wesley with the bits. That's a cool rating. Right? What you have, you should give it to me. <laughs> Nikki Jimster, thank you so much for the seven months. Devastating Chow, thank you for the gifting sub. Game ball with the 14. Oh, I did not cut straight across. Whoops. Raz, thank you for the five months. Do you think the Q becoming open source is overall a positive thing that happened in the community? Any additional thoughts on how it impacts the community? Gifted Eric, thanks for the prime. Oh man. Um, overall positive? I think so. I mean, I don't think there's ever any, I don't know if there's a detriment to having more knowledge out there, more open source. Uh, there are, There is a potential, it can be a negative, um, but I don't think it's a bad thing that Quantric released his files. I mean, it, it is his files. He could do whatever he wants with it. <laughs> um, it might clog up potential factories if people start running group eyes because they want their own queue. Um, that's probably the biggest downside that I see. But other than that, I think overall the net is still a positive. Ooh, this is the inside. Oh, I got four candies. Very nice. Oh my goodness, what? Tim Keyless, holy, thank you so much for the five gift of subs. Oh my goodness. Mm. I wonder how many candy they've purchased. <laughs> Sup, Big Daddy? Dude, thank you so much for the five gift of subs. Stop gifting, man. <laughs> Use it on your girlfriend. Okay, we got the PCB here, as well as the plate. Oh wait, this is not a plate. Why is it so heavy? Hmm? Hold on. Hold on. There's no way this is a plate. Why is this so freaking heavy? <clears throat> Do you know approximately when the number 265 will go out? I am not sure when it will run, but I'm guessing pretty soon. Uh, there would have been no reason for Keycult to overnight this for me to show this off to you guys unless they were intending to release it pretty soon. So my guess is probably before Christmas is my guess they're going to drop the number 265. Hmm, I hope I can show this off. They didn't tell me anything about secret stuff. Okay. Ooh, comes wrapped in this towel. <gasps> Is this one of the towels Mr. George and Riot use for their machining to clean parts? Ooh. Wait a minute. <gasps> oh. They sent out a special. Oh. Look at the way that catches the light. <laughs> Holy moly. Yo, I think this is even better than the vertical tooling pattern of the Grove Mate. Having it diagonally, it catches light in a very interesting way. Not that I would ever see this during use. <laughs> Unfortunately, this is going on the bottom. <laughs> but this looks so nice. Wow. And they had my logo engraved. Thank you so much, Key Cult. 
So yeah, you can see the tooling pattern. I will say this is not for everyone, but I personally, I've been liking, I don't know, just more raw stuff like this. You need a new logo, bro? GG, do I need to rebrand? You don't like my logo? Everyone already knows me for this logo though. Should I make a new logo? Should I hire someone new to rebrand again? Oh, let's take a look at the other side, hold on. Ooh. That's cool. That's cool. Yeah. I feel like not everyone, I mean, if it's your first keyboard, maybe you might not want such a, I guess this is a more loud design. Some might view it as less polished, but yeah, I feel like the longer you stay in the hobby, the more you start to appreciate some of the more like, I don't know, raw. <laughs> I don't know what to call it other than raw. <laughs> Something different, something unique. I mean, this is this is definitely nice too. But I already have many keyboards with brass bottoms like this. Joyous whale, thanks for the seven months tail likes a raw. Okay. Uh, Opticating the three months. Thanks for getting me this hobby. Just put my KB seventy five and I'm hooked on mechanical keyboard. Here we go, man. Thank you. Chubies with the bits. Hello. Greetings, Nathan and friends. It is Tuesday. Please have a happy Tuesday. Jack Static name is gifting a sub. The bridge runner with the prime. Jack Static, holy things are the five gift the subs too. Thank you, thank you. And Metki Momo with the nine months. What's popping? You know I'm gonna hit that one year. I'm gonna keep reminding you. Thank you. All right, I think I'm caught up. Let us unbox the plate and PCB. Oh. Ooh, a love letter? I don't know what this white stuff is. Not gonna question it. Ooh. It's not a love letter, but <laughs> this is a. I guess this is considered Key Cult's COA, Card of Authenticity. Very nice touch. I like. Just tells you the model number. No love note this time, but it's okay. It's okay. Death left you some love. Uh, yeah, they gave, they gave me some other kind of love. I will gladly take it. Uh, Delaphine, they're gonna do nine months. Doctor, they're gonna do two months. His band, they're gonna do four months. All right, I still really like Key Colt's wrapping paper. Very cool. What plate was I sent this time? Ooh, black aluminum. Very nice. FR4, Key Cult does not do FR4. Currently, I don't think they ever have done FR4. I don't know, maybe in the future they might. I am perfectly happy with aluminum. Aluminum is still my favorite plate material. Uh, did the cutouts change? I don't know, maybe it just looks different because it's black. I don't know if they changed the leaf spring cutouts. I don't remember having seen this cut so deep here. I don't know, maybe they did change. Maybe it's the same. But aluminum is still the best plate in my opinion. Death looks different? Okay, maybe it is. I thought I was, I mean, I, my memory fails me, but yeah, I don't remember it having this big of a cut. Like the cuts look a bit more continuous and it like it protrudes out here a little bit too. Maybe it is different, maybe it's not. No way to tell. Also, hold on, this should be, Okay, PCB. Ooh, got sent two PCBs. I do like having extras. 
Oh, Taco, hello. Long time no see, man. Ah, they still haven't increased the size. Though. <laughs> I wish the PCB bag was ever so slightly wider. Okay, he's removing it. Okay. Oh, that one was pretty effortless. Maybe they did widen it. In the past, I usually struggle, but this one was smooth. Just cut it open. I don't want to damage it by like miss accidentally slashing too hard, you know. Well, the PCB always looks so nice. Did the color of the red change? Has it just been a long time? Hmm. It almost looks like a purplish red this time around. I don't know, maybe it's just lighting. Well, the PCB never gets old so good? Yeah. How does it look on this camera? Yeah, it almost looks purplish. There's like a... I don't remember seeing it this in this hue. <laughs> hmm. Maybe they did slightly change stuff. Because I remember Woba's PCBs just being like a pure red. This looks different. I mean, it depends on the lighting angle, but probably different batch. I don't know. Maybe the batch just messed up on coloring. Who knows? All right, let's test this PCB out. Oh, let me put this away. Don't need this no more. A zesty red? <laughs> Yo, croissant, hello. All right. Tranquinity, things for the 16 months. Shen Kizaki with the tier one. People sad with the 11. Delaphine with the nine. Thank you, thank you. Nathan, is your color grading? I, I'm not even color grading though. This is just straight out of the camera, it's OBS. I have no filter on for the C200. It's OBS as color grading that uh, Fs up. Uh, bring out Via here. Okay, what layout do we go? Full backspace, yes. Enter, right shift. Which bottom row chat, 7U or 6U? Only looks funny on the ISO. 7U, 6U. Split, 313? I can't split though, there's no support. Is this plate fixed? Plate not fixed. I think I'm seeing more 7U. I guess we'll go 7U. Oh wait, there's 6U. Ew. No, we're going 7U. <laughs> Key tester, test matrix. Here we go. Not with that approach? What do you mean? <laughs> Uh, yo, Sean, thanks for the 17 months. Lol, Ham Kenobi with the 22. Dot Matrix, thanks for the 3 months. Alright, 7 new wins. Go to the polling station. How's everyone's weekend? What is he probing the PCB with? Yes, these are just, they're just tweezers that I got from Amazon. Nothing special. Why are you proving a Wilba PCB? What?
What do you mean? What what is proving? Branded tweezers? I don't think these are branded at all. <laughs> it really does not matter which tweezer you use. As long as it's thin enough that you could stick in between the two holes. <laughs> you don't even have to use tweezers. Anything that conducts electricity works. I'm not using some like off-brand high-end tweezer. <laughs> Literally does not matter. Are you dumb or just pretending? Uh, maybe I'm both. How about that, huh? Why does it have to be an or? It could be an and. Can you rig the prediction? What? Just use the points to make the push-ups. Oh crap, has anyone redeemed push-ups? PCB works fine, <sighs> which means we can move on. And since you guys, where are my push-ups? No one's redeemed so far. Oh crap, someone just redeemed. 20 push-ups? Oh my, Zombamal redeemed too. <laughs> Snarky snot, thank you so much for the two months. Elite loaf. Thank you so much for the host. Thank you, thank you. Wait, why am I a scammer now? You guys are so aggro today. We're at 30? All right, this is for Zambumon and Old Bites first. I don't know if I can get to Matcha Matsus yet. We'll do 20 right now. This is for Zambumon and Matcha. Oh, can I think of them? Now 50? Bruh. Oh, my poner and bowl cut gamer. All right, uh, maybe in a bit. I feel the coffee. Let's do stabs. How about after stabs, I'll do push-ups. After stabs. Do it now, go back. What if I can't do it though? Wait, 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 what is this long message? Are you interested in a potential sponsorship? I represent a brand called Dickens Cider. On a warm summer's day, your girlfriend will love... Is this bait, ramen champ? <laughs> what is this? Okay, buddy. <laughs> I knew I knew it. I just wanted to read the first I just wanted to read the first line. Come on. Why no Cyber Monday sale on push-ups? Okay, buddy. Macho Matsu and Poner, are you guys here? Let me see if I can another 20. I don't know if I could do another 30. Macho Matsu and Poner, are you guys here? 
Damn it, Matcha Matcha is here. Fuck. Oh, Poner is not here. Oh, damn it, Poner is here. Fudge. All right. This is for Matcha Matcha and Poner. Oh, my wrist. Six, four more. Ah. All right. I did 50. There's no way we're doing stabs in under an hour now. You have missed two? No, I have not. I did all 50. Wait, what do you mean missed two? You miscounted the push-ups? Okay, buddy. Whoops. Oh, I'm out of shape. I stopped doing Chloe Ting because no time. <sighs> Maybe I should do Chloe Ting again. <sighs> Stabs are painful. How many sets of GMK Gregory will you get from Tia Keyboards? I'm just gonna get one. <laughs> one is enough. Oh, my arms are so jelly. So are you gonna, okay, Mr. Tim. Okay, Mr. Tim. Big milk things for the seven months. Glad I could catch a stream. Persian Nike things for the tier two for seven months. Paulo Gigi with the two months. Changasaurus thinking of the bits. You are really gorgeous. I would fight three mountain lions in a McDonald's ha handicapped bathroom stall with my hands tied behind my back. I feel like I've read this. And my only weapon is a shake weight super glue to my forehead just to get a chance to have a spaghetti dinner date with you. Okay, buddy. Torn things are the prime, cartoon things are the bits. Under one hour stab bribes. I don't think bribes are gonna even work. My arms are gone. Asian things are the two months. Roll bag for egg with the prime. Monka Minka things are the 14 months. ASAP Curry with the prime. Pillow Bay with the bits. TBB Profit things are the two months. Let's lube the stabs. Are you gonna have merch anytime soon? Um, yeah, merch is taking a while. <laughs> merch is taking a while. I am doing everything that I can to make it happen. It will happen. It's just, uh, it's been long. Which stabs are those? These are Duroc V1 stabilizers. <sighs> How have you been liking 3 to 3 on your creams and your Vega? It's nice. Uh, I lubed it pretty thin. I But I did it, I lubed it thin with the intent to rebuild this anyways. Once everything's broken in nicely, I will be rebuilding it. 
I'm probably looping it with 205 grade zero when I do, but that won't be for like a, at least a year, I'd say. <sighs> playing cards? I would like to have playing cards as merch. That is not currently in my pipeline though. A Tia types playing card would be nice though. But playing cards, I feel like I could always do whenever. So I'm not in a rush for playing cards. <sighs> merch will happen. It will also sell out if run in a limited amount. Uh, merch definitely will be limited. I'm not doing an open pre-order. I'm fronting everything up front. So it will be a limited thing, but I'm trying to, I'm trying to order as much as I can. I am, yeah, I'm quite literally buying as many unit counts as I can. Are you a fan of polycarb case? Yes. Moist has a large, what the heck is that? Huge load, come on. Thank you so much for the bits. What is that collection? Mega thingy, thank you so much for the bits. Flinksy with the two months. CFDJ with the prime. <sighs> Look, Teha, not being funny, mate, but we both know you've been inconsistent and kind of flaking on this, so let's lay it all down on the table, mate. Can you please show? Wait a minute, isn't, <laughs> isn't this a soju copy pasta? No, no, don't. I don't bring his coffee pastas here. I love the guy, but <laughs> his coffee pastas are something else. Holy crap. I feel so bad for Soju. <laughs> the amount, <laughs> the kind of coffee pastas he gets. Holy crap, man. I don't know how he does it. Soju chatters have migrated. No, no, please don't come here. Go somewhere else. Go, go spam those coffee pastas in another chat. <laughs> <laughs> he knows, dude. I watch Soju. He's so funny. <laughs> this is with sub mode on? Yeah, sub mode is no longer safe. Oh god. Time to move to float plane. To be fair, you need to have a very high IQ to understand Rick and Morty. Oh, I've seen that copy pasta. I like Rick and Morty. A huge pet peeve of mine is X so it. Sar so lit, Calliope so hype. Oh, I think I, was it Poner? I think Poner said that in my Discord, right? I heard you thought so do you. Dude, I even know what you're talking about. No, I have not taught anyone how to steal TVs. Come on. Oh my goodness. What is copy pasta? What copy pasta? How do you explain copy pasta to someone who doesn't know what copy pasta is? It's, it's like, it's like someone types in something pretty mean that's clearly fake. And then everyone just starts copy pasting it. That's what a copy pasta is. Oh my god. Where, is there a database for all these copy pastas? Holy crap, where are you guys pulling these all off from? How do you guys have them on the archive? I don't understand. Yeah, is there a copy pasta library? I've never s bothered to look into it. Sumi Masen bitch, what? <laughs> what the heck? Oh my goodness. Our copy pasta, really? Oh my. Oh my. I feel robbed and cheated. For the last year, I have spent thousands joining various group buys. Joining various group buys for mid to high end boards. I feel that I have been taken advantage of by the private group buy runners in the keyboard community. Here we have the epitome of what a keyboard should be at a price. 
That is what all other group buys should have been. How could private group buy runners sleep at night, right? I mean, they are all the same aluminum rectangles, right? This should be a lesson to all that paid hundreds of... Oh, is this... Is this a copy pasta from the uh, GMMK Pro thread? Holy, I just scrolled so much. It's just full of cop... Oh my goodness. <laughs> what has happened to chat? GG. I'm not even the original that said that? Oh. Wait, what is Zombaman's copy pasta? Someone suggested the other day that this key kit should be run again. So I figured why not, maybe there's enough interest to warrant a second round. V2 as I call it, will have a very different kit structure than the initial run. Before we find the current version of them, they are not final and thus, I don't know where this copy pasta is from. Anyways, I bought a whole bunch of key cult keywords. Do you know what key cult is? Anybody know what key cult is? No, not K cult. I think they are running soon. I'm talking key cult. Anyways, it's a $2 billion like company. He will heard that it protects against scalpers and wanted flips that may be traveling in the market. That's my story. I put a whole bunch of stuff, put it around the casa. What is this? Oh my goodness. This chat is doomed now. Is it worth it to film MK creams? Nope, it is not. In my opinion, no need to film creams. Zias, hello. What is going on here? This is what happens, Zias. You left, and now Taya Types is going into ruins. Rogue Architect in two months. Trying to decide on a PC or aluminum plate for the Vega. Did you get given the aluminum, and would you have preferred polycarbonate? I was given aluminum. I really like aluminum. I have not tried polycarbonate, so cannot say. But aluminum is my favorite plate material. I am perfectly content. I'm more than happy with the typing experience of this aluminum plate. Zetsu with the prime, roses are guarding the bits. Look what you have done. Copy pasta everywhere. It's not me. What are you guys doing? Hello, Taya Types. Are you getting a Q one off made? No, I have a Q. Now imagine if it wasn't sub. Wait, is it not sub only? Dude, we must, we must enable sub only. Oh no, my OBS. Oh, okay. Oh no, it is sub only. It's sub only already. <laughs> Holy moly, you guys are ridiculous. Your subs are this Papega? No, I knew. I always knew my subs were Papega. This is this is the state of Tia types. This is the state of the average intellect of the keyboard enthusiast. <laughs> X Buck, thank you so much for the host. OG Zap, thank you so much for the tier one sub. Chat is strange today? <laughs> yeah. Chat is indeed strange. Maybe they all have some pent up frustrations. I'll let it, I'll let them let it out. I'll be your punching bag for today. Let it out. Tomorrow is emote only stream. Whoa, Vaded Matt, thank you so much for the five gift of subs. Thank you, thank you. That's because you didn't stream yesterday? All right, it wasn't my fault. Are you gonna do KBD67 Lite build in the future? Uh, I don't know. Mr. Wei has not told me yet that I will be getting one. If he does send it, I definitely will though. Man, I'm still sweating. Do you care if we call you Nason? Or do you put up a tail? Also, did you see Kaksino Yuxibo Posen? I think it's hilarious, you kids. Alright, I've seen this copy pasta. 
Will you be doing the Alpine 65? Yes, I will also be building the Alpine 65. I forget, I think it may be next week. I have received a prototype to build. I'm surprised so many people so many people are hyped for Alpine 65. Or, or maybe they're buying accounts. Maybe they are self-generating hype, who knows. I feel like I have been asked an ungodly amount for the Alpine 65. Holy moly. <laughs> yeah, just like buy it. <laughs> Still sweating, feels bad. By the way, there is a track that is DMCA free. Will you give it a listen? You're gonna troll me, huh, Soran? Is it gotcha? Gachi? Gachi? It's not troll, I promise. All right, sure. If you send a picture of that meme, if it's not even a video, <laughs> I swear to God. <laughs> DM'd? I have a feeling it's going to be that image. Oh, okay. It's good, trust me. Do I trust Soran? I'm to understand, dude. Me too, Kuroi. I don't really know much about Doc. I've never watched his stuff. I just know he's a two timer. The only meme I know is the two timing and the Shungai, but that I even learned through chat. <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> what is this? is distracting you so you don't finish the half? Is that what this is? Oh hey, it's Ninja. Who's this guy? Who's the yellow haired guy? Okay. Not my cup of music. Oh, that was Tifu. Oh, I see. That makes sense. Didn't really look like Tifu. Other than the yellow hair. Ninja kind of looks like Ninja, but. Spread this out a little too far.
Is this tool 5G0? Yes, this is. Imagine not putting Tia Tice in that video. Okay. Are you and Tifu best buds? Uh, don't think I can claim that really. <laughs> oh, hey Nathan, I was wondering if you could kiss webcam same time as I do, so it's like we e kiss. What is this? Okay, buddy. <laughs> Rat IRL kiss. What? Does Tifu text you to see how you are doing during the holidays? No, I don't even have Tifu's number. Kai's and Fennec thing shows the 15 months. Andy J came during the tier one. Mo X squared during the four months. FMPs with the tier one. Uh, Summer Salt thing shows the 11 months. Do you care if we call you Nathan or do you prefer Teha? Also, did you see Gox new 65%? I have no preference for Nathan or Teha, whatever you guys want. It seems like a lot of new folks don't know my English name is Nathan though. Uh, yes, I did see Gox new 65. I saw it on his Instagram. It looks pretty nice. It looked like it had a similar uh, weight back design to the 7V. The USB port cutout looking kind of nice, exciting. Mega thinking even a bit. Recommend the switch holder when lubing switches. I personally do not use switch holders. But if you like it, go ahead. Can we please bro fist? No. Nathan, I'm waiting for the E kiss. Wait, is there? This has to be a trap. I'm gonna get clipped and something's gonna happen. No, no E kiss for you, ZS. I will only give you an IRL kiss. No E kiss. IRL kiss or go home. Hundreds of people lits on lens right now. Please give me a goodbye e kiss. No. Especially you, ZS. You have left me. You don't deserve one anymore. Can I get one of those kisses? No. Maybe I should make it a tier on my Patreon. $50 a month, I will send you an e kiss every month. How about that? Should I make it a new tier on the Tia Types Patreon? Put on Tia Pipes. How about a Sudamsuda? <laughs> How about a hundred dollars and we kiss IRL? Nah. <laughs> Dude, chat is so pent up. Now that it is December, Hi, Tayo, how now that no nut November is over, all these pent up folks in chat, they're trying to use me. They're trying to use and abuse and then just dump me to release their hormones. <laughs> Couldn't wait to tune into Teha's stream to celebrate the ending of NNN. Okay, buddy. Two more stabs. <clears throat> Yo, Teo, on some real, my pour over sucks right now. Is it just going to, until I find great local beans, get a burr grinder? Um, it depends. I mean, I don't know what you're using right now to grind your beans, but ideally getting the fresh, getting fresh beans definitely changes the taste quite a bit. Having a grind, having a good grinder is probably the most important for pour overs. Uh, it might also just be your technique. I don't, I don't know your technique. <laughs> or even if I do know what technique you're following, maybe you're not following it properly. 
Hard to really say without seeing what you're saying. Fresh bean and good grinder for sure, yeah. Yo, Arthot, hello. Thank you for the six months. It was a pleasure meeting you at the meetup, bro. I just wanted to let you know. Meeting you and other streamers inspired me, and I'll be getting starting soon. Ooh, congrats. I mean, you have your brother to help out too, so hope it goes well, man. Hope your streams go well. Ducks on Quok. Thank you so much for the dip. tip. Can I get a Raul? What's a Raul? Isn't that a name? Mohuru Koda. Thank you for the prime Uber eater thing in two months. Hello, Nathan, you lovely boy. I have a question. I want you to take my money for your information head. Is it worth it to lube film alpacas? Thanks for all the streams. Wow, what an interesting <laughs> introduction. Thank you. Yes, I think lubing and filming alpacas are a must. My oh my, thank you so much for three months. How was your day? It's been good. Bolt is, thank you for the two months. Didn't even know I had auto renewal, but hey, take my money basis. <laughs> thank you, thank you. <laughs> um, Jose, thanks for the bits. Tan name Hoxi B box. B box? What is B box? Gongi Chamiya Jan Nile, Rev 2, 65% ka Madurji, Kunguma Haseo. B box ka boya? What's the B? Is there a keyboard named the B box? They're stalling you. <laughs> Do you feel. Lonely. Do you like tea types? Get ready for Nathan's new show, the tea, the tea hollerat. Find your keyboard, perfect keyboard soulmate, the gummy gasket of your goose kit. Oh, that's not a bad idea, actually. Lover host, but like keyboard edition. Mmm, that's not bad. That could be an entertaining show. Should I make my reality of Kieber, or should I make my idea of Kieber into a reality? Just turn it into a Twitch show segment? <clears throat> Do you watch AOT? Yes, I am excited for the, for the final season. I am excited for that whole saga to end. Um, B-Box is that 60% that's like a Gundam form where you pick out pieces. Oh, I have seen this. I did see this, yes. I... I don't know... <laughs> I mean, I haven't tried it. So I can't say if I like it or not. The idea is definitely cool though. If it feels any decent, uh, I mean, the price point is going to be pretty nice, I think, if I remember correctly. That should be nice. Yeah, I mean, it's so cheap. The, the idea definitely seems cool. Foolish magic, they the four months. Did you see those new NKC5 colors? I did, it looks very nice. Very, very nice. Nothing better than the Crytox I produced. Okay, JK Keys. <laughs> Freaking show. Uh, FFC emote stopped showing up in the on-screen chat. Oh, did it? Oh no. Maybe they're going through some stuff. Hmm. Something sounds loud. Is it my PC fan? Oh crap, I forgot to... I did play around with the fan settings, hold on. I will change it after the fact.
Plexi door, things are a bit. Why are you not using dielectric grease? I have stopped using it. I have a command, I think. Keha, I beg you, please do not ignore my question once again. What do you think about lubing stabs? Is it worth it? Yes. Should I lube my grandma with... What? Dude, that's sick, Zabuman. What are you doing with your grandma? <laughs> chat today. Yeah, chat is something special today. I think you need new mods. Yeah, maybe. Chat today is wild, dude. Dude. Have we reached peak Twitch chat? Has has Tia Types chat finally normalized with Twitch norms? We chillin'? <laughs> Lightning keyboards, hello. Can I V can I be a VIP please? No. Can we do another best mod vote? There was never a vote. <laughs> horse Pepe Sad. What is horse? What? Dude, you guys are wild. Nathan, want to play the quirked game? What's the quirked game? I've never heard of the quirked. Oh, what you played on stream? With, uh, with Huey and Hugo? Yeah, I don't know. I saw court and I thought of Quop for some reason. I was like, there's no way he's asking me to play Quop. Uh, sure, I'm going to play court game. No, actually, I'm kind of scared though. Lightning was very good at typing handicapped. Co-op slaps? Yeah. Uh, John Fiora, thanks for the bits. Do you feel lonely? Okay, buddy. <laughs> Admiral X, thanks for the tier 1 sub. I am handicapped. <laughs> Hello, can I ask some questions? Is this server? Okay, buddy. Yo, check this out. It says Linus Tech Tips. All right, I'm gonna click it. Is it the meme? Oh, it's not the meme. Oh, wait, is this gonna leak anything? Hold on. Hide my DMs. Nothing leak. A bowl here, all right. Dude, look at this. New workshop looking fly app. Whoa. Dude, this is the dream, having your own workshop. I mean, I'm very far out from needing one. It would be nice though, if I just had one at my disposal to just use. That's so lit. We got the compressed air. <clears throat> yeah. Dude, look at all this real estate. That's what I want. I just want more real estate. Plus, they can put whatever they want on the ceiling, it looks like. That's so lit. I would love to put more stuff on the ceiling. I just can't. <laughs> It'd be so nice if I could just like install a rail system, have lights moving around on the rails on the ceiling. So I don't need to have light stands on the ground. All these like rolling cabinet orc bench stuff. So lit. Has yeah, TI finally normalized with Twitch and SA? What do you think we are, you little dick? We are the best chat to ever exist. We flex with key cults and shit TDRs. If someone asks, what is good entry keyboard? We just say get an OTD mini, easy clap, GGW play. You newbies go. <laughs> oh boy. 
Hey, how media group gonna be solid? That would be nice. That would be nice. Hey, how media group? I could have people coming in every day to help me with editing and filming and other stuff. That would make my life so easy. Okay. So today's switches, I'm hoping they turn out okay. They still don't feel like amazing, but they're definitely way better than its original state. Cherry MX Blacks, but I have swapped the stem for V1 Umwipe stems. Rather early V1 stems actually. These are like super early batch. Uh, switch foam from TX, as well as uh, 62 gram TX regular springs. And I have lubed it with 3203. Uh, Umwipe linear stems, by the way, not the tactile. Yeah, it still doesn't feel super amazing, but we'll see. Maybe in a year or two, these will be very nice. But they're definitely better than... Oh wait, this sounds a little scratchy. Oh, did I pass an hour? Nice. Nice. GG channel points. I don't think you ever use your keyboard for that long. That is true. I have been going through keyboards pretty regularly. Um, update, I still could not find the seven new space bar for my uh, oblivion kit. I don't know what the cats did with it. We distracted you though. <laughs> Are you getting quest two for Xmas? What's quest two? Wait, what's quest one? Oh, VR? I don't know. I, I don't even have VR equipment. <laughs> I, uh, I'm not I'm not a VR person still. Do I need to film Novel Key's blueberries? I'm going to say no. Flibble, thank you so much for six months. Nexonus, thank you so much for the prime. Oh. Bottom out sounding interesting. I think there's no stab rattle. What are you gonna put your Dracula on any pumps in? Didn't you mix in the SETI spacebar? Is that what I did? That's very possible. Hold on. Telling me it's in here. No. This is not oblivion. Hold on.
No, it's not there. I don't know where it went. Maybe I did. I'll have to check to all the kids. Alright. Set this all aside. Good night, Soren. Alright, have a good night, Soren. Wired controller, things from the seven months. G Oblivion Space Run win. Repaired air, things from the T1. Who is Jeff? Things from the three months. What are you gonna put your Dracula on when it comes? I'm not too sure. I feel like Dracula won't look good on a black keyboard. I'm thinking maybe a white keyboard. Dracula on white? Did you cop how you? I did. Gray? Gray would look. Yeah. Yeah. I just feel like black isn't the move for Dracula. Greetings, old person. What did you do with the leftover palm stems? Uh, what are you talking about in this? From what? Don't worry, we have plenty of time to find the boy for Dracula. <laughs> yeah, true. Uh, you swap the stems with butt wipes. Yes. You mean the leftover from the leftover butt wipe stems? Oh, I just have it in a box. <laughs> Why 3 till 3 on blacks? Because this is still pretty scratchy. I am definitely going to have to rebuild this. Um, and I wanted to break it in much quicker. So I thought no point in moving it with Crytox 205G0 right now. Where's Joe? Things from the 17 months. Microdose Alpha, things from the five months. Greetings, old person. <laughs> Where are the original stems? Oh, the original stems in the black? I threw them away. Oh. Why not just go stock? Because I could always go stock. <laughs> were they that bad? Yeah, they were pretty bad. And I've got tons of tons more MX blacks I could use, so. How are you liking the Vega? I am loving it. It's a very nice keyboard. Is there a general methodology that determines whether a switch would be better lube by 3203 versus 3204? Uh, no, not really. Have you tried the hyper tooled MX Blacks? Not yet. But I have, from what I've heard, it seems like it's just batch dependent as well, which kind of defeats the purpose. <laughs> Sorry, hyper MX Blacks. Well, what, are, what are they calling it? Hyper, it's not hyper tooled. It's like hyper, hyper glides. Hyper glide Blacks? Hyper, it's hyper something. Yeah, hyperglide, yeah. It seems like it's just batch dependent as well, so. I don't see what the point is really. <laughs> like if you're going to have to cherry pick hyperglides, nothing's really changed. It's not that batch dependent, I think, but there is definitely variance within my batches. Yeah, I mean, if you're buying it now, you're also being, you're also getting it lucky because the mold is rather fresh. As more people buy it though, assuming people start buying it, 
I figure the batch dependency is also going to get much worse. Uh, it's, it sounds like some people were happy with it though. People whose opinions I trust, they said their batches they were pretty happy with. But it didn't, it didn't sound like they were amazing linears either. It seems like they were just slightly better retolds. You sons of batches. Hello, Mr. Dixie. Is it worth lubing my razor greens? If you want to, sure. Tilt Lord, thanks for the five months kick, Butzler. Thank you so much for the six. Glad I could be a part of this. Thank you. Are the seven and eight keys on Vega misaligned due to the USB cutout? And switches being upside down. I don't know, does mine look misaligned? I mean, there's slight variance, but I think that's more so the keycap. It's also hard to show from the top-down angle. The perspective isn't perfect. Yeah, it's probably perspective. I mean, I'm, from my point of view, it looks fine to me. What switches shall I get? Whatever you want. <laughs> get whatever switch you want. Use it for gaming mostly. Use the switch that is comfortable for you to use. Try out a bunch of switches and stick with it. Aren't the seven and eight keys north facing? Yeah, it was for... Uh, I don't think this had a daughter board, did it? Did it? Yeah, either daughter board or, but it's for the USB thingy. Okay. Oh, I hope I have enough switch. <gasps> Did I not lube enough switches? Wait, I swear I lubed 70. She. Maybe I didn't lube enough. Wait, there's no way I didn't lube enough. Where, what went wrong? Oh, there's this. Did I, did I lose some switches? Wait a minute. <laughs> the stream has officially ended? No, we can just lube on stream. I thought I lubed enough. Maybe I didn't lube 70. or whatever. Okay, we are missing four switches. All right, I guess we'll lube on stream. I did not forget, I just had not grabbed all of them. Um, I just polished my stock MX black with 80 grit sandpaper and I love the tactility, nice. Where do you get your coffee beans? Uh, just locally for the most part. I have been, my latest batch of beans I have purchased from Maru.
Okay, we can get to soldering. I went to Maro last week. Ooh. Yeah, I've been liking their beans after... It was a viewer. I still don't know who sent it, but a viewer sent out a bag of their beans to me. And I have been in love with them after trying it out. Very nice brand. Very nice roaster. And their coffee, I mean, their, their physical location looks very uh, aesthetic. Exo Homes, they were two months. How do you find the kind of switch you like? You try out a bunch of switches. Enable, they were the prime, 90555, they the prime, purple haze, they the prime. You try out a bunch of switches um, and you just build a lot of keyboards. You don't have to purchase a new keyboard for every build. You can buy a hot swap keyboard and just swap out the switches. But just try it. I could give you all of my thoughts on switches. And maybe it works, maybe it doesn't for some people, but the best way is for you to just try it. People are so scared to just try things. Try it. I might even say keep a journal. Maybe that's, that's a video I should make in the future, a keyboard journal. Maybe we should encourage people to keep keyboard journals. ASMR key switch journal writing. Haven't you been keeping a journal recently? Yeah, I, rec I only recently started, but I have a different use case. I should have honestly started keeping a journal of keyboards long ago. I just don't like writing, <laughs> but um, uh, I definitely should. And I have started keeping a keyboard journal. Snakezilla, things are the prime. Yeah, my journey is going back to my Corsair for my Topra. <laughs> GG. Notion sponsored keyboard journal. I'm actually not using Notion for my keyboard journal. I can't even read my own handwriting. Well, it doesn't have to be a physical journal. You can just, you can type it up. <laughs> it is 2020. All right, shall we get to soldering? We have a couple sponsors for Tia Types. The first sponsor that we have is Dixie Mech. Head on over to dixiemech.com slash types. GMK Think Caps, still live, running until the 13th, I believe. You guys have exactly 13 days until Think Caps is over. Go check it out. I do have an affiliate link. Please consider using it if you want to help support the channel, as well as a discount for Dixie Mech using code sweet tay at checkout saves you 5% off in stock items like desk mats and other knickknacks on Dixie's website. Uh, is your Google Sheets page for keyboards up to date by chance? It is probably not. The next sponsor that we have is KBD Fans. Head on over to kbdfans.com. The uh, you can currently take advantage of the Black Friday Cyber Monday sale still on KBD fans. And they did announce the KBD 67 Lite. Go check it out. See if that's something you want to go for. KBD fans is where I recommend most beginners to start off. Where do you get your cables? I have not purchased cables for a long time. I did recently though pick up some stuff from I think his Instagram name is Keeb Stuff. He's been making some pretty nice cables. Uh, I picked up some um, ba -ba 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 -ba, some of his metal sleeved cables. I've been I have one stainless steel sleeved cable that I really liked, and I feel like not many people are doing metal sleeves for their cables. Have you ever built your own cable? I have. Yes. 
I will say my cable working needs a lot of practice. Metal sleeve cables are thank you. Yeah. Uh, Keep stuff Mark one is so nice, white with steel wrapped end. Yeah, he's been doing some nice work. Uh, I believe he actually gave me tracking not too long ago, so hopefully it gets to me sometime soon and I can show it off on stream. But yeah, I mean, I per I've been in the hobby for a while, so I just, I've collected cables over the years. Cables aren't something I regularly purchase. They last a pretty long time. Uh, Helen Husandi, thanks for the six months. The next sponsor, as well as today's sponsor of the stream is Key Cult. Head on over to keycult.com. As I mentioned before, I don't know when the uh, release date for this keyboard is, but I'm going to guess pretty soon, Key Cult will be announcing. Uh, oh, they're actually having their update stream this Thursday. They will probably announce, I'm going to guess, when this number 265 drop will happen. So hopefully you guys have some holiday funds to join in on this keyboard. Uh, I mean, you guys already know. <laughs> you guys already know this is going to be a nice keyboard. I've been a big fan of the uh, number 265 raw aluminum version they sent out. This is just now the polished final production unit. I'm going to guess they will probably offer a couple more colorways than just this black and brass, but yeah, check out keycult.com and definitely tune in to their update stream this week on twitch.tv slash keycult. What time is update stream? I don't remember. They might have said it on their Discord. I mean, yeah, Discord page. I forget the time, but I do know they're doing one this Thursday. Wave Dev, thanks for two months. Next sponsor that we have is Novel Keys. Head on over to novelkeys.xyz. JTK Grizzian, still live. GMK Yuri, round two, still live as well. GMK Honor has closed. Uh, also, check out Novel Keys' Instagram. They've been dropping some, they've been dropping a couple upcoming teases for NK65 news. So be sure to check out Novel Keys. I do have a discount code with Novel Keys using code Teha Keys at checkout saves you 5% off in stock items. <sighs> Doesn't Honor close tonight? Is it tonight? I saw their page. GMK Honor was taken down from the front page. I assumed it closed. I could be wrong. I did check though before stream. Yeah, new colorways as well. Uh, Novel Keys also has desk mats, switches, springs. Uh, they have a wide variety of stuff on the website. Go check them out. The next sponsor on our list is Prime Keyboards. Head on over to primekb.com slash teatypes. Uh, you can purchase some desk keys films. Silent Alpaca is still in stock. Uh, I think T1s as well, still in stock, I forget. But check out Prime Keyboards. They've got some nice stuff as well. Not as much as other stuff, but desk key switch films, very nice. Oh, and they've got springs as well, I think. Next, we have Switch Mod. Ooh, big news from Switch Mod. Head on over to switchmod.net slash types because Muted is back. A set that everyone thought would never come back has been revived from the dead. Switch Mod has succeeded to convince J Chan to give him blessing to bring back Muted. The interest check for Muted 2 is up on Geekak. The group buy will be running relatively shortly. Check it out. Uh, Sifu there, thanks for the Prime sub. Hi, it's me, actually, thanks for two months. Just want to say hi, Heath. It's Javant, thanks for the Prime. Thank you, thank you. Coil or no coil cables? I am leaning towards no coil as of late. I'm kind of over coiled cables. 
It was cool at first. Uh, I don't care for it anymore. <laughs> Just take some space. I'm over the look of coiled cables too. Straight is the way to go. But people really like their coiled. I don't think coiled cables are disappearing. Definitely a look. My girl stretched all my coils out. What? Dude, dump her. That's so toxic. Why would your girlfriend stretch out all your coils? That's an insta dump. Dump and don't even look back. She belongs to the streets? She does it when she's stressed? Oh, are you stressing her out? Maybe you're the problem. You're probably stressing her out, so she's getting back at you by unraveling those coils. Are you a bad boyfriend, Arthur? <laughs> the next sponsor that we have, final sponsor that we have is Zeal. Head on over to zealpc.net slash teotypes. You can pick up some fancy boutique switches like Helios V2, Zelios V2s, Helios Xilence. Check out zopc.net slash teotypes. Hopefully you guys all take advantage of their Black Friday, Cyber Monday sales, as well as from other vendors. He might be stressing her out by buying the cold cables. You should request to get dumped. <laughs> Do you usually film Gat Inks? I think so, yes. Stress sucks, but why the story cable? Oh, I mean, some people... It works for some people, just being destructive. Don't they have like rage rooms? I don't know what they call it, but like you can pay to go to a, a place and they just let you like break stuff for like an hour and you just get all your stress out. I, I don't know what they're called. I think my, my friends have definitely gone to it though. They probably thought of me as they swung the bat in the raid room. Did you see that one typing test when mentally stretched out a coiled cable? I did not. How did you find out about my secret batting closet? Do you think black Vega or gray Vega will look better with EPBT 3000 sat? Ooh. I'm going to lean gray. I don't know, I kind of haven't been liking many sets on black keyboards as of late, other than GMK white on black. <laughs> Maybe I'm going through like a monochrome phase. I've been really into like darker, darker stuff lately. Oh, there you go. The man himself, Gox, says go gray. Yeah, I think gray would look nice with 3000 sat. Bit message ignored. Oh, oops, sorry. Cheeky visuals, name of the bits. My drop control plus holy panda build is double typing within the first month of use on multiple switches. Do you think that's a PCB or switch issue? I'm thinking it's PCB. I'm a good boy and didn't spill anything. Uh, well, if you try multiple switches and regardless of which switch you're using, it's double clicking, then that's definitely a PCB problem. Unless you just happen to have extremely unlucky uh, statistics and just every switch you've put on it happened to be a chattering switch, but I'm going to bet that is most likely not the case. It's, it very well could be a PCB problem. It might also be the socket has come loose. Maybe because you took out switches so many times, the socket has become loose, so the connection isn't as strong and that's causing it to chatter. Is that darn auto drawn PCB? Yeah. Uh, did you join the Dalco 959 mini raffle? I did not. I don't know that would be the worst, but it's weird. It either doesn't type, types it twice. Mm, yeah, it might be. It's probably a PCB problem then. <clears throat> also, 
assuming assuming no more delays and shipping i think i am streaming every day until like the 15th no until like the 13th or 12th i'm streaming every day this month i'm pretty sure so <laughs> if you guys I don't know if you guys like my streams or don't like my streams. I'm streaming every day. <laughs> Feels bad. I'm streaming every day until the 12th, I think. Uh, I will probably take the 14th off. And then we'll see how much of the holidays I take off. I'll, uh, yeah, we'll see. I, I, I'm definitely streaming throughout the end of the year, but maybe not as frequently. I do need to work on my uh, videos too. <laughs> I need to film my videos. Whoa, Esden, thank you so much for the host. Hello, hello, how are you guys doing? What do you stream, Miss or Mr. Esden? Are you a keyboard streamer? I work at a photo lab, so I'm always listening while at work. Ooh, wait, Plutonium, which photo lab do you work at? Can I send you film to develop? at a discounted rate. Do you guys develop film? Every day until the 12th? I think so, yeah. Assuming no delays in shipping. I could get cut, but I'm trying to pump out, I'm trying to like crunch everything early December so I can take some time off <laughs> for the holidays. <laughs> I'm in Canada? Oh, GG. <laughs> I am not sending my film to Canada, unfortunately. Way too far. I was hoping you'd be more local. How many subs do you have to gift if you don't make that lubing video? I said 200. Swift Dev, thanks for the Prime. Corno Graphic, thanks for the three months. Uh, Ox Deck with the Prime. Esden, thanks for the Prime. And hello, basic. Also, you guys notice something different today about the stream? Does anything look different? Can you guys even tell? <laughs> anything look different about these angles? Yes, no. You got a haircut? No. More bokeh? No, my f-stop has stayed the same. <laughs> Yo, hello, Caleb. You dyed your hair? No, I did not. Tubes are higher? That's possible other than that. New light? No, not new light, same lights. Okay, you guys are just straight up guessing at this point now. <laughs> All right, you guys are guessing. <laughs> you swapped sides? No. No, I just changed the lighting positions a little. I don't know if there's a difference in my, I think the lighting looks different to me at least, but yeah, I, I wasn't a fan of my lighting. Still not 100% satisfied, but I wanted a bit more, I wanted more shaping to my face, more, some more shadows here. The thing is, I don't know, I've been having trouble lighting both my face and this desk evenly. Not evenly, but either one ends up being too dark, one ends up being too, too dark. So maybe I just need to, I don't want to bring up more lights. I'm satisfied with you? Okay. I thought the brightness was a sarvasin, no. You want that chiseled jawline? Yeah, I'm trying to make myself look skinnier. Know what I'm saying? Cause, ideally, do you guys like this better? 
Do you guys like this fill or no? I guess I could reduce this a little bit. On, off, on, off. But if I turn this off, now this looks really dark. No difference? What? There's a big difference. The feel when Teha takes your compliment and throws it in the trash? Okay, buddy. Maybe on, but very light. Okay, this you, you can't even actually tell on stream. That you can tell. Hmm, maybe we'll put this. Your face looks more accentuated? Yeah, I, does, I do like how it shapes my face better with it off. Going for that moody, contrasty look. I also want my key light to be bigger, but I have no space. Because I realized it doesn't really matter how dark it was in the past. I just tried to light everything evenly, but I realized it doesn't matter matter how light or dark this part is because it's always covered by chat. So I just realistically need to light this part of my stream. And it actually looks, you can read chat much more easily if it's darker here, so. I've decided to not light everything just straight on. Because I, I show off everything in like this two thirds of the video. Hit 200 words per minute, 120 seconds today, I'll give one. <laughs> Okay, buddy. <laughs> Shin Unicorn, thanks for the tip. It does not let me sub, so I donate instead. It's not a lot. I'm sorry, but I really enjoy watching your streams. Shin Unicorn, thanks for the tip. You don't have to be sorry about not subbing. Thank you so much for the donation. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, no need to feel bad about not subbing. Not a worry at all. Manoli Visuals, thanks for the six months. Inbound with the tier one. Uh, Pinto Paper with the four. Thank you. Just got off work and opened up a bottle of wine. Hope y'all are doing well. Ooh, wine sounds nice. I have not drank wine in a while. Would love to see a photo of your lighting setup. I am currently working on my setup tour video. Ooh, another another question. Do P is a setup tour? Do I include gear in that? Or is there a difference between setup and gear tour? Or do I just combine it all into one long video? Yes, show gear. Cause if I talk about every gear that I use, I mean it could potentially be like a 20 minute video which isn't gonna be nice for the YouTube algorithm. So do I make, but what separates a setup? I feel like my setup isn't long, isn't big enough. I can talk about gear for a lot, but setup, I don't know what separates a setup. 20 minutes is not my, not that bad. I guess that's true. My viewers are accustomed to long form content. That's the nice part. That's the nice thing about keyboard viewers. They're okay with three hour videos. <laughs> but even still, it doesn't do well on the algorithm, I feel like. You could do a setup video first and a video gear, but what, what, what would make a setup video different from a gear video? Because like setup and gear is kind of, they're kind of tied to each other, no? Um, you also kind of show, yeah, I, I did show off my setup uh, bits and pieces. I mean, you guys have seen my setup. This is pretty much it, but I guess just up close, people still want to see. I haven't really shown off like what, how I organize my cabinets over there. Uh, maybe go over your, how your setup is functional. Then you can do a video of why you chose the gear you have. Mm. 
I'm imagining MKBHD setup tour versus Peter McKinnon, what's in my bag? That's different though. What's in my bag is very different from setup. <laughs> you can shove a lot into a bag and talk about it. Setup equals layout and how you made those choices. Gear equals details about how you configure items. Mmm, I see. I see. Studio tour over a setup tour. Mm, okay, I'll have to think about it. Because I'm like, I'm pretty much done with the script for the setup tour. And it's not going to be hard to film, but... I'm wondering, yeah, I, I, I've been wondering <laughs> if I should just make one giant video or... It's what's in my bag COVID edition. <laughs> oh, did you guys all see NKBHD's icon stuff? How do you guys feel about that? Do you guys like it? Dislike it? Neutral? Do you guys even use dbrand products? TT thongs aren't already a thing in your merch lineup. Hit me up. Okay, Poke Park Turtle. Thank you for the 14 months, though. Shoku Ponic. Thank you for the tier one. Uh, John Fear, thank you for A setup video just show the behind the scenes and the gear show name what you use. Justifies you in a prime sub. I see. Not a fan, says Jay. I order from my iPad. I like to give me tech LV vibes. Snapbacks. Western family all day. I want the R5. Oh yeah, his giveaway was insane. <laughs> the giveaway was insane. I feel pretty neutral on icons. It seems kind of cringe and too much like copyright infringement. Is it copyright infringement? That's a good question. I did I did have that in the back of my mind. Because um, the artwork is all original. Or I mean, he probably... I'm guessing he hired and got the proper licenses for the artwork. At least in terms of like the actual art itself. But is he crossing IP when he's using other brand identities in a sense? In the icons thing? It looks nice though. It looks nice. It's not for me though. It's way too... it's kind of loud. <laughs> but it does look nice. I thought the art style was nice. Pretty safe art style. Alright, I finished soldering. Ooh. His colors would make a nice keycap set, I reckon. Yeah, red and black, pretty nice. All right, let us test the stabilizers. Using Delta. Because I have no idea where my obsidian went. See, now this looks a little dark. Hmm, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. GMK Metaverse shipping soon? Ooh. Uh, enter is fixed. As well as, oh, I don't even need to test enter actually. Pipe is fixed. I do need to check. Um, left shift is fixed. Nice. Backspace does need checking though. I need to, hold on. Better. 
Mm, but now I'm too bright. That's too bright. 50? Is this bright enough? I think it's just a desk mat. It feels bad. That's the other thing I realized. Using a dark desk mat kind of sucks for video purposes. <laughs> it just like eats, eats up the keyboard. Which is sad. Seems like you're loving your Vega. I am loving my Vega. Okay, I'm pretty sure bottom row is going to be just to be safe. Okay, bottom row looks good. Bottom row does look good. Yo, Keone, hello. Always blame Nathan, everything is his fault. What? All right, split, I mean, backspace looks pretty straight as well. Only thing left to check is caps lock. I don't have stepped caps for this. I am just going to, just this once, I'm going to gamble that this stepped caps is straight. I'm just going to gamble on it. Normally I would check for straightness, but I think it's fine. Key cold plates never lost. All right, let's see if I missed any switches. I have zero channel points. It's K round two or Vega. Please help me make up my mind. Well, they're different form factors. <laughs> um, in terms of typing experience, I think I did like the Vega more. Aesthetically, I like K. I think acoustically, I like Vega more too. If if you like, if aesthetics is your number one priority, go with K. If typing experience and sound is your priority, I think go with Vega. Vega's pretty nice. Last time you gambled on a bill, we had a DOA PCB. Okay, that is true. <laughs> oh, does Alt Tab not work? Hold on. Configure. Is this not Alt? Let's see, test matrix. Hmm. Oh, I didn't solder, whoops. <laughs> Did not solder a switch, hold on. No wonder it wasn't working. <laughs> Scuffed. Geo, hello, how are you doing? <clears throat> Reset the keyboard. All right, now it works. Dink. We can assemble this keyboard. I think, okay, how are you, Papa? Are you still buying knives, Geo? Are you still buying knives? I'm doing good. Just finished soldering. I'm gonna go wash my hands. Be right back, chat.
regalo. Kotawi, thank you for the two months. Bike, big chode, thank you for the three months. Fat Johnny with the tier one. Goals, ghouls, thank you for the prime. Retro Maple, thank you for the eight months. Good morning. Did you get anything for Black Friday, Cyber Monday? I did. I picked up my first uh, Arcteryx jacket. I realized I don't really have anything for warmer stuff other than a hoodie. And sometimes hoodies don't cut it for me anymore. My fat is not as effective as it used to be. Um, oh my goodness, ramen chat builds. Holy, thank you so much for the 10 gift of subs. Oh my, thank you, ramen. Dalt x Savage Real thing for the bits. All right, you are now condoned for baiting me with the, the cider. <laughs> Chico Suave, thank you for three months. TR with the Prime. Tomasi with the 13 months. Thank you, thank you, everyone. All right. Dead bird life, yeah. Yeah, I'm also potentially going to, not potentially, I am going to go to Joshua Tree, I think, over the holidays, so. It might be a little cold. Okay, let us build up this keyboard any chance you know of a budget key set that is that has the c i am not too sure <laughs> i don't really pay attention to foreign legending for foreign keycaps uh especially portuguese that's pretty rare i don't know unfortunately i need hex is a 2.0 hex. Yes, this is 2.0. Kilo whiskey one things for the prime stuff. I grew up in Santa Monica, then went to Oregon for underground. All of a sudden, there's a damn ice storm and trees are falling into dorms. And I had a hoodie and vans, lol. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, if you live in SoCal, you don't, there's no real need for like heavy duty stuff. A while ago, you changed the resolution on your camera to zoom out. Does your camera impose a 4K crop? Yes. I stream with the EOS R. There is a 1.7 zoom crop between 4K and 1080. There's quite a bit of a crop on this camera. SoCal sucks? Okay, Gio. Where do you live, Gio? Actually, don't talk to yourself, but... SoCal is not too bad. I probably envision myself living in SoCal for the majority of my life. Whether I retire or get rich, I feel like I'll still be around here. Unless I get absolutely poor, then SoCal might be out of the question. SoCal is expensive. A lot of what you earn in SoCal goes to rent. <laughs> Just California in general. Ooh, all right. This is the base plate. Take this out for now. North Carolina is the new California? Ooh, I don't know about that. <laughs> Kaizen Bay Area? Bay Area is expensive to you. All right. Ooh, baseball. What do I even do with this? Ooh, I could potentially put this on the raw aluminum. This is nice though. But this, you will not need. Because we have the new bottom. I'd rather live anywhere else than SoCal, really? I wanna move to Texas? Texas? 
feel like everyone's going to flock to Texas, and Texas will very quickly become expensive. Oh, what is this white stuff? Oh, it's the, it's from this, the bump on, what the? Or is Texas already expensive? I pay $1,400 for a four bedroom townhouse come to Florida? Man. That does sound nice. If I moved to Florida, I could probably afford to like have a legit studio and hire someone. <laughs> I don't, doing so in California is so much more expensive. Do not come to Florida. We have tremendous backyards. Outdoor builds. It's getting more expensive though because Californians are starting to move out here. Yeah, and I mean, and Texas is also just a quickly growing uh, tech bubble. Well, it's, I feel like it's been a tech bubble for a long time, but it'll only probably speed up in terms of tech companies moving out there. Move to Montana like Sushi Dragon? Oh, but there's nothing out in Montana. How's my second favorite streamer doing today? Okay, that's toxic, Chongasaurus. <laughs> Florida has toddler eating gators too. Move to Alabama. All right, one of my criteria for moving, I need access to, to good Korean food. Okay, wait, maybe I don't even need access to Korean food but I would like at least a Korean market if I'm moving out of California. I don't know if Alabama has a single Korean market. Do they? Move to Korean. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Canada sounds nice, but that will make all my keyboard purchases very expensive. All right. Top piece is off. If I remember correctly, I just realized I wasn't sent Alignment posts. Wait a minute. No alignment posts. I don't think it was in a bag. Is it in the extra PCB bag? Nope. Man, oh wells. I guess that's the price I pay. You get a custom bottom, but no alignment posts. That's okay. Okay, so what we need to do, so we need to put this back in. Key called saw you don't know how to use. What do you mean I don't know how to use? I do know how to use. Okay, we're gonna need to install this back. Los Angeles is where I was born and Los Angeles is where I'll stay. Mm. Los Angeles is expensive though. I do like LA as a city, but too expensive to live there now. And then we insert this here. Okay. And then this goes here. Oh, what is that noise? Huh? 
this piece goes on top. Is a number two gasket mount as well? Yes. All of Keycolt's keyboards so far have been gasket mount. I may even dare say Keycolt is probably the reason why Gasket mounting has become a thing. <laughs> They're not the first to gasket mount, but Key Cult definitely was one of the early, early uh, folks to adopt gasket mounting and popularize it in the West. Gasket mount isn't new, but yeah, Key Cult's to blame for gasket mount. If someone ever makes a keyboard documentary and they talk about gasket mounting, you cannot leave Keycolt out of the story. Okay, let us tighten this. My keyboard has gasket. When's the next gaming stream though? Probably next year. Maybe you should make that documentary. A documentary on just Gasket mount? <laughs> that would be an interesting documentary. Can I can someone really make a documentary on the history of gaskets? Alright. That's been tightened. This is what a key call looks like without the base plate. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. How do you feel about a beginner building in a Rama TKO? Rama keyboards are not too... I mean, they're definitely expensive, but especially if you go hot swap, they're not too hard to build. I wouldn't say Rama keyboards are necessarily, I mean, I feel like people, I don't know. I don't know if that's a mis, a preconceived notion people have that more expensive keyboards are harder to build, but it's not really the case. Just depends on the design. Oh, wait, 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 Okay, maybe we should do this. Which base will you use? Hello, Mr. Oh, you changed your name to KC George. I gotta go with this. I mean, you sent me a custom personal one. You bet I'm going to use it, Mr. George. Thank you. It looks beautiful. I don't know if you caught it earlier on stream, but I like the side. I like the diagonal pattern a lot more than just the vertical you did for the Grove made one or you or Riot did, whoever did. I do like this diagonally a lot better. <gasps> Wait, I just noticed. I didn't catch this at first. <gasps> he even did my logo here. What? I did not catch that. Whoa, I just saw this. I didn't include blump bonds. Yeah, you didn't in include blump bonds, Mr. George. Also, you did not send me the uh, the alignment posts. No alignment pins on this. Feels bad. I think he called has a crush on you. I wish. They unfortunately have families of their own. 
and I don't take them to be home wreckers. <laughs> I do like Kikot though. All right, let us tighten the base plate. I'll send some tomorrow. Ooh, thank you. And I gotta make sure you don't over tighten the base plates. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, how did that screw? Oh, okay. Wait a minute. Hmm? How did that screw leave its hole? Hold on, abort, abort. One of the screws has left its hole. I was supposed to get done with homework three hours ago. Gee, go focus, Dustin. What happened? So you're supposed to put these screws in before you attach the base plate. Now this is just my error. Can you even see the hole? Okay, you cannot see the screw at all. <laughs> but there's a screw in there underneath all these holes but this one has not sitting properly which I don't know why I just positioned it poorly when I built this <laughs> going to have to undo all this then Don't worry, keep practicing. <laughs> okay, Jax. <laughs> okay, Jax. I do wonder. Have I have I assembled more key cult keyboards than key cult have? I mean they definitely prototype. But I feel like there is a possibility I may have assembled Keycult boards more often than Keycult has. The full board, I mean. He should have started with Taravati. <laughs> there should be seven screws. One, two, three. Six, seven. Hmm. Okay, make sure they're all in properly. Have you been to Vancouver? Never in my life. Have I been to Canada ever? The rock stabs, yes. Okay, all the screws are in there. Okay. 
and tighten this. Is it pro is it pronounced Durock or Durock? That's a good question. I'm not too sure. I always just went Durock. <laughs> is there an official pronunciation for Durock? Do some people say Durock? Derek, do you do rock? I always think of Turok. What? People say do rock and I hate it. I don't know. It's possible do rock is the official way. I don't know if they've ever come out with a statement saying one is the way over the other. Waiting for a designer to correct and say it's pronounced Rayma works. That's never happening. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. I don't think as anyone has said it's Rayma works. <laughs> like experimenting with different spring weights and different lengths, 14 and 16. And I think I just found my end game spring. Nice. If that's what you like, that's perfectly fine. It's pronounced Keb D fans. Oh my goodness, you're ridiculous. What stabs is he seeing? Duroc stabs. What switches are the stems from? They are not from any stem. These are UHMWPE stems you could purchase. I got mine from uh, AE keyboards. AE board, sorry. Did I tighten this enough? Okay, it's just a little more. Oh man, a, this is a fingerprint magnet. We are done assembling the board. <sighs> All right, what keycaps have to put on this? And don't say white on black because I don't have any extra white on blacks. <laughs> I do not have an extra white on black. You should have, I do have one, it's right here. But I like this one, this one's thick. I always have one right next to me. White on black? I don't have any new ones. I would have to yoink it from an existing set. Do I actually yoink? Olivia plus plus? Ooh, Olivia plus plus will work. Uh, let me see. Hold on, let me clean up a bit. Noir in about a year? Yeah, I don't have Noir yet. Hmm. What set fits on here? Rudy or Violet on creams? I have neither. Cafe, I do not have. Poner saying white on black. I don't even know where I can yoink a white on black from. Hold on. Let me check my inventory. If we go to inventory. What has white on black? My gasket has white on black? 
my Rukia has- Wait! How come only two white on blacks are in use? I have- Do I take it from my- I'm taking it from my Rukia. Mm, do I take it from my Rukia or my Gasket? Which set to yoink it from? This needs Serica? I could do Serica. Yoink from Rukia? All right, chat has spoken. Rukia is getting yoinked today. Friendship with Rugia is coming to an end. The hunger white on black will now be transferred. Man, I do need to purchase more white on black still. <laughs> I'm realizing two is not enough for me. You had you on the wrong side? Wait, what? Oh, what do you mean on the wrong side? This is the only proper side. You should open a pop-up keyboard museum. Okay, how do I don't <laughs> I don't have the money to just open up a pop-up museum. Ooh, maybe Dr do you guys think Dracula would look good on Polycarb? I'm trying to envision Dracula on this. Dracula might look nice on Polycarb, actually. Right hand B is trash. Imagine being a right hand B user. You have Dracula? Yes, I have the fabled, legended Dracula. Dixie has sent one early to me. No, I'm just kidding. I'm, just, I'm saying when it ships. We were talking about earlier in chat. What, what color case would work best with Dracula? And I said not black. All the renders for Dracula are on black cases though. Yeah, that's where they're wrong, kiddo. Did you get GMK Nord? I did not. You're a full black works with everything. I'm your young? That's where you're wrong, kiddo. <laughs> you wanna sell me that white on black hunger? Dude, this is, I cannot sell this. Z, X, C, V, B. Holy God, how the F did I miss Dracula? Yeah, imagine sleeping on Dracula. You want to use that the next time I get a proto? I'm down. Wait, you're getting a second proto? Ooh, this is actually... Oh, it's kind of smooth. Nice. 
I, I do need to re-lube some of them though, I hear ticking. Maybe the spring didn't get enough, GG. What Apple face watch do you have? I have the uh, GMT watch face. I will take all the naps on Dracula. <laughs> Hey Nathan, next time you need someone to carry you on Apex, let me know. I i don't even... What? <laughs> I've never played Apex in my, in my whole life. I want to try Umripe Trays? Yeah, I wanted to try mostly for the sound. I want to see how it sounds. This isn't going to sound the best. It still needs a bit of break-in in my opinion. But this makes it very usable. It's very usable, yeah. <clears throat> Those are retold housing? Yes. I probably purchased these retold blacks. I purchased stuff from Novel Keys, I don't even know how many years ago, maybe two years ago? I mean, a bit of scratch and cherries make it sound better in my opinion. Whoa. Why do you say that? You like that kind of softness it adds to the sound? I do know some people genuinely like... They like... How do I describe it? Like, there's, there's bad scratchy sounds and there's like... There's bearable, okay scratchy sounds. I do know some people don't mind like the bearable. Because Wesley is a masochist? No, I mean like, like some people, it's kind of like why some people like white noise, right? Like I don't think white noise particularly sounds nice, but there is kind of like a soothingness to it if it's constant. Nice. Okay, I need enter. Ooh, let's use these. Transfer this. I think it sounds deeper. Interesting. Should Dixie reopen the Dracula group by? Uh, I don't know why he would. <laughs> I just need 70 space bar. Remove the legendables. You don't like the reg you don't like the legendables. Or should I make the whole top row legendables? How about that? Make a clean build. Fine. Ooh.
Huh? Do we use some Salvin Artisan keycaps? Oh, no Legendables. But I don't think it's from the Prime. Carl thinks it's from the Prime. Walker thinks... Oh god. Hope that did not pop the wire. Sean Bueller with the eight months, Joran Andy with the two months. Let's do. <laughs> Insert page up, page down. Oh, this. Wait, this kind of looks sick. Hold on, enter, entertain me, chat, for a moment. What if this makes sense? Like more often than not, when you're gaming, you move forward a lot. You move left and right a lot. How often do you move back? Maybe it makes more sense to have up here. And then when you do need to go back, you go down, you do this. Maybe it makes sense. Chat, do we use a Salvin Artisan, yes or no? Salvin Artisan, yes or no? Place your votes. Uh, I should also remove these keeps. find another set to put on the Rukia. Ooh, chat voted yes. All right, chat, vote yes or no. Do we go with the Tokebi artisan? Or do we go with the logo artisan? Yes or no. Tokebi or the logo artisan? Both are from Salvin. as I eat another key cult candy. Hmm, can't vote him. No, wow. Wow, wow. Salvin Artisan sounds nice. Sounds thick. Yo, why are you leaking? What do you mean? <laughs> this isn't the first time. I unboxed this a while ago. It showed on stream.
here we have the completed build of today. This is, oh no! <laughs> Wait a minute. How did this happen? <laughs> Alright, uh, minus this weight, if you guys get the production unit, you guys will most likely be getting a base plate like this, both brass, but just different finishes, different logo, you guys will have the key cult logo, obviously. But, black and gold, I mean brass, ooh, fine combo. Base plate looking nice? Yeah, base plate looks amazing on the key coat. This is the top. How much is it? If I had to guess the price point of the number 265, I'm gonna say. If I had to guess, probably. Probably four, high 400s, 500, 800 for black brass? Oh crap, I'm way off. Okay, I lied. <laughs> 800, okay, there you go. Wait, 800 for black brass? Really? I guess it's, I guess the made in USA. That's literally what they said on their stream? I see. I was expecting 400. <laughs> Do we use code? Yes, using code TEA types at checkout will save you 50%. If you know this, don't share the coupon code. Only available for the first, uh, first 50 folks that use it. Number two, revision one was 850. That's right. I've just been basing everything off the, my stainless steel, I guess, which was two years ago. <laughs> Cause the stainless steel, wasn't the retail for the number two stainless steel 800? But, okay. That was a miscalculation on my end. I calculated too far back. But it looks nice. Can we get the uh, words per minute bot mods while I take a screenshot of this? Dang, which angle do I use for the screenshot? Number two stainless steel was 885. Mm. What happened to the top feet? They forgot to send me some. They had it on the original. They had it on the original base plate. They sent me a custom extra base plate and forgot the bump ons on that, but that's okay. I already used five desk math. Oh no, you can see. Hold, hold on. Pricey for me as I'm from EU. Oh, good luck, EU. Shipping probably expensive because this board just weighs a lot. All right. Let's bring this down. GG won't play EU. Let me pop. Oh, plug this in. Hold on. 
Did this cable just die on me? <laughs> Okay, why did that not work? It's working now. <laughs> we are good. Oh, I got scared. All right, this is the production unit of the number 265, black and brass edition, built with an aluminum plate, Duroc stabilizers, and Cherry MX blacks that were stem swapped with V1 UHMW PE stems, lubed with Herbosus 3 3, 62 gram regular TX springs, TX switch filmed as well. Keycaps are GMK white on black. And this is what this sounds like. One fifty. Here we come. Bad day. Decline. No. Uh, I did hover for over 150 ish for longer though. For a little bit longer. All right. I just got to build up. I think at this point, I just have to build endurance. I, I just can't maintain 150 for a whole minute. Like, I just, towards the end, I start making mistakes and my acre just tanks. Wait, what happens if it's 140? Which group won? See details. Oh, 140 Worshmen are over. Dang, this was a good run. Landed exactly at 140. <sighs> Whoopsie, whoopee stems sound nice? Yeah, I am like, I'm very happy with the results of this so far. Uh, in a, I, could, I think maybe just a couple months, it'll be in pretty good shape. These are what the mods sound like. Oh, this has a Salvin Artisan. I like the plate. It's got, I don't know how to, it's got that leaf spring property. I don't know how to describe it. But you can feel the vibration uh, just slightly. It's not an insane amount. I forget what Kimchi Jody Boy called it. Someone named a term for this. Yeah, you can feel a slight amount of the vibration on the keyboard. but it's not super overbearing. No, no, I mean, no, what I'm talking about is like, 
I've only, ex I mean, you can feel this with some boards, but generally on leaf spring plate, oh my. Like when you, when you type on one end, you can feel the vibration on this end, like a decent amount. People are saying compared to Vega. Okay, different switches, different uh, plate style cutouts, but if you guys want a difference, this is what the Vega sounds like. I mean, it's not a fair comparison. <laughs> Very different builds. This isn't scientific at all. Yeah, this, <laughs> this sound test tells you nothing. If you like either one, you just happen to like the build specifically. But it doesn't really, <laughs> it doesn't determine anything in my opinion. What is your morning hand stretch routine? I do a lot of this. I do a bit of this. Uh, I do this. It tells me I like keyboards. Yeah, sure. <clears throat> All right, one more typing test. Uh, I am liking, I mean, number two, I love it. I am liking this cherry housing with the umwipe stem. Is there a coined term for this? Is, has the community coined a term yet? Should we just call them like repurposed blacks? Bum wiped blacks? I don't know. Uh, how does the smoothness of those switches compare to inks? Compared to inks. At least with these specific ones, uh, they are, this is highly dependent on your Cherry MX Blacks. Uh, I did cherry pick these, but I think I, sh I didn't have enough time. I literally lubed these last night because uh, I found out I had to provide switches for this. <laughs> so I didn't have as much time as I wanted to cherry pick, but you do need to cherry pick. Some of them could be replaced, I think. There's a slight taking to some of these, but this one, I would say inks are still smoother, but these aren't far off. These are for sure smoother than stock creams, in my opinion. These feel like creams that have been broken in for like two months. They are pretty, they're very usable, I would say. If you're looking for absolute smoothness, these aren't it. But they sound pretty nice. A pretty cheap-ish way to not waste cherry black switches. Sounds and feels pretty good to me. Bum it. <laughs> yeah, I have found you needed to cherry pick. Does anyone want the keycaps talk about? This is GMK white on black with the GMK white on black hunger add-on kit. Are GAT inks fine without films? I would personally film black inks. 
It also depends on how decent your retools are. Yeah, it does depend on your retools. MX bum wipes. <laughs> okay, one more. One more typing test. Oh my. Oh, what a... This board looks nice though. Yeah. Kiko boards always look nice. Bring back the music. Oh, I will say I did not use five desk mats today. I have used five desk mats for quite a while, but I'm getting old now. Moving around five desk mats is a little hard for me. So I, this was, today was on two desk mats. Only two today. Today we are much closer to the desk. No, no, I'm only on two. I'm on two desk mats. But that was the typing test. Pillow bait thing with the bits. Cam got with the two month prime. Uh, but I don't with the bits. The Kiwi thing with the host, not Zepsy with the tier two. Thank you. Chimp Vian with the prime. Aiden Noon with the prime. Kanito with the prime. But I don't with the prime. I think I'm caught up. Uh, someone said, what does the side look like? Let me unplug this, actually. This is the side. Actually, let's just use this camera. It's the side profile. It's the back profile. This is the bottom. Looks so average, no hate here. Yeah, well, I mean, from the top, from the top or side view, this doesn't look all that exotic. I do agree, but I don't know if, like overall as a keyboard, I wouldn't say this is average. You know, this is just, it's simple and clean done right. I feel like key cult aesthetic, at least a number two aesthetic, it's one of those, if you know, you know kind of deals. Like I would say the number one, I mean, it might look more advanced. It looks a bit more, I don't know, exotic. The, uh, the aesthetics of this is definitely more understated. But I love the number, I personally like the number two series much more than the number one. Maniacs do things for two months. What's your favorite board of all time? It's still my number two stainless steel. Are you gonna give the new board from Glorious a shot? Wondering your thoughts on it. I am hoping I get sent one. Maybe I won't. <laughs> I did not purchase it yet though. I'll just purchase it after the fact. 
I can't deny the design of the case is quite nice. I love the proportions of the top and bottom bezels. Yeah, it's something people like. Well, it's a mixed camp, right? Some people like having an even bezel throughout. Uh, I personally like when the bottom and top has a little bit more meat than the side. And then the, the ratio between the top and bottom and the side also very important. Some boards I feel like have a not so great ratio of fat between top and bottom. But the Kiko one is a pretty nice ratio. MS Dying Star. MS Dying Star during the Prime Sub Maniacs do during the two months. Vega side profile is more appealing IMO. Really? Oh, whoops. I personally like the number two side profile better. I don't know. I mean, this this is a very classic. This is a very classic keyboard side profile. But I don't know. It's not. It's not my favorite. It's def It's not ugly. It's not my favorite though. But I mean, this is a classic. Tons of keyboards have this side profile look. The back looks pretty nice though. Bottom looks pretty nice. Seamless looks better. I don't know if it's the seam. Like I, I personally don't mind seams. I know some people are crazy about seamless. I never really had an issue with seams. I mean, as long as like it doesn't accentuate a flaw. <laughs> I personally never really cared whether a board had a seam or not. I think it's just more so like the angling. I don't know, just the overall shape of this uh, side profile. I don't know, I'm just not super keen about. I do personally, I don't know, this just looks, it looks elegant. It's got, it's got class. I also really love the little dip on the number two series. I don't know how many of you go, how many of you guys have owned or seen a number two in person, but this edge sits against the table and then there's a slight lip up here that lifts the top edge up ever so slightly. I love this little lip. I think it looks nice. I love the look of that keyboard. Black on black looks clean and the proportions are just right. I agree. Austin Masayuki, English was a three months. Uh, all right. How long did that take? Three and a half hours. I think that is it for today's stream. Tomorrow is a EU friendly stream. Yes, EU friendly stream tomorrow's Wednesday, yeah. Stream tomorrow at 10 a.m. Pacific. See you guys then. So drop test or not? Nah? No, I only have two desk mats now. <laughs> no drop test. No drop test today. I just got here, GG. Thoughts on Sukuyomi? It's a 65% blocker top right corner keyboard. Uh, I did think it was expensive, but it's also being picked up by Canon Keys, so oh, I'm pretty sure it'll go well. Canon Keys is a vendor that has proven themselves and uh, established themselves these past couple, past couple months. Have they been operating for a year? Has it been a year for them? Uh, ramen champ builds is live. <clears throat> oh crap, let me go touch. Ooh. Do we raid ramen? Basics live too. We were gonna raid basic last time, but we ended up going with someone else. Ramen or basic? Uh, 
Thanks for stream. Thanks for having me. Wait, Zuck is live? What is Zuck streaming? Zuckus? <laughs> this guy's actually... <laughs> oh, man. Do you rate Zuck or do you rate Basic? I was gonna rate Basic, actually. Dang, this is hard. Basic, Zuck, Ramen. Oh, Red Redacted S is live, too. Dang, so many options. Should we put a poll? Can we get a poll between Basic, Zuck, Ramen, and Redacted S? Nathan Raid Zuck? Ooh. It's hard. Wait, how do I make a poll? Poll. Oh, just kidding. Someone made it. Who to raid? Wait, we left out ramen in the list. <laughs> Wait. Wait, 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 we left out ramen. Wait a minute. How do I, how do I cancel? Can you cancel a poll? Hey, Nathan just got here looking forward to the stream. Okay, buddy, that's toxic. <laughs> I think we just have to wait until this minute is over. GG. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we just have to wait until it's over. Ooh, wait, question chat, question. Let's, let's talk. Let's say, I, let's say hypothetically, I start making actual review YouTube videos next year on a keyboard. What are, what are talking points you guys would like to see or know about a keyboard? Like I said, I, I started to journal like keyboards that I've had experience with. I'm wondering how much of each keyboard I need to, like how much do I need to document? Typing, I mean, other than the, I mean, obviously I'll cover typing experience, I'll cover acoustics, I'll cover aesthetics. Uh, oh, what actual screws are used? Ooh, what screw? <sighs> but that requires me to reach out to every designer because I don't think most designers release like screw size information. Durability? Ease to build. Is ease of build actually important though? Like do I need to address how easy something is to build in a custom mechanical keyboard? Does it affect someone's buying decision? Value, I mean, yeah, that'll be covered. Price to quality, yeah. Build quality, cost, benefit value, durability. Really, what keyboard have you guys decided to not purchase because it was too hard to assemble? Name me a keyboard that you guys just refuse to build. Hi, I am gonna stream. <laughs> this guy, wait, you're not even on the list. Oh, ramen one, okay. Do we take a re-vote now that lightning has entered the poll? <laughs> Do we re-vote? Do we recount? Available PCBs. I am trying to keep track of unit count. Yes, I am going to keep track of unit count. Uh, one talking point could be like, if it's a group I already ran, is it worth to pay for aftermarket? Mm. Well, I don't see myself reviewing boards that have already run. This is for the future. I'll probably try to review boards like that are coming out or as they come out. I don't think I'm going to like review all the boards that I have already. I don't know if that's necessarily of value. Um, type K Tenta looks like a spicy one. Type K looks nice, yeah. Is Tiny not an option to rate? No, Tiny, I mean, there's a lot live, but I've rated Tiny pretty recently. I rated Chubies pretty recently. So I'm trying to rate someone I haven't rated. All right, I guess we can rate Mr. Ramen. I think Ramen won. <sighs> keyboard firmware, I am keeping track of keyboard firmware. Raid Ramen, 
champ. Uh, ramen champ builds, right? Did you buy honor? I did not. Not how hard it is to build, but how it comes together after build. Gaps, mismatches, non-matched Anna. Okay. Okay. Make sure to review upgradeability, customizability. Review how easy it is to clone so you can post on Reddit. <laughs> how easy it is to clone? Oh my goodness. Uh, I don't buy any board that is not QMK supported cap. Yo, Zerpocalypse, hello. Any keycaps you're insta buying in the near future? Yes, GMK Serica round two, because I do not have. And I regret it not joining in on round one. When did the build start? Dude, I'm done. Come on. Personal views on the angles, line aesthetics? Yeah, I mean, that's that's something that's pretty basic. I definitely cover that. I'm trying to think of like non non obvious things you guys would be interested in. <laughs> yeah, once I have more of a database, I'll show you guys what I've been how I've been keeping track. Uh, hey man, I'm new. When are we starting stab prep? Okay, buddy. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Have fun in Ramen's build. Uh, it is our first time raiding him. So, you guys... Wait, this USB just straight... I mean, this cable just straight up died. It won't... None of my keyboards will recognize it. GG. I think that's his name, right? Ramen Champ builds. You guys know the drill. First time raiding someone. Runner history? Yeah, I am also trying to keep tabs on people in the hobby. I have pages for the group by runners. Medius nut meat. Thank you so much for the prime. Egrim signature for six months. All right, Doctor Who. Hello, the good stream buddy. As always, thank you, thank you. I'll see you guys all tomorrow. Have fun in Ramen's build. He's building a KSE. Let's check out how his K build goes. I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye bye.